went into the meeting place. A man with a crippled hand was there. The Pharisees wanted to accuse Jesus of doing something wrong, and they kept watching to see if Jesus would heal him on the Sabbath. Jesus told the man to stand up where everyone could see him. Then he asked, On the Sabbath, should we do good deeds or evil deeds? Should we save someone's life or destroy it? But no one said a word. Jesus was angry as he looked around at the people. Yet he felt sorry for them because they were so stubborn. Then he told the man, Stretch out your hand. He did, and his bad hand was healed. The Pharisees left, and right away they started making plans with Herod followers to kill Jesus. Jesus led his disciples down the shore of the lake. Large crowds followed him from Galilee, Judah, and Jerusalem. People came from Idoma, as well as the other places east of the Jordan River. They also came from the region around the cities of Tyre and Sidon. All these crowds came because they heard what Jesus was doing. He even had to tell his disciples to get a boat ready to keep him from being crushed by the crowds. After Jesus had healed many people, the other sick people begged him to let them touch him. And whenever any evil spirits saw Jesus, they would fall to the ground and shout,